Hello students. Today, this is the second video regarding the topic meta sentence. As in the previous video, we have seen and we have solved one problem where uh, the weight of the stone in air was given to you and the weight of the stone in water was given to you. And we have found out what is the specific gravity and the volume of the stone. So, let us see one more problem. Here you can see there is a body of dimensions uh, 1.5 meters, 1 meter and 2 meter whose weight is 196.2 Newton. Calculate the volume of the stone. Okay. Find its weight in air and what will be its specific gravity. So, let us solve uh, this problem. Now, what is the, what are the dimensions of the body? So, here the basic thing which we are going to find, as for the problem, what you have to find out? You have to find out what is its weight in air and its specific gravity. That means, the body which is having the dimensions of 1.5 meter into 1 into 2 meter, what will be its weight in air and what will be its specific gravity, these are the two things we are going to find out. So, what is the given data here? So, let us solve it. So, given data, from the given data, let us find out what is the volume of the body. So, what is the volume of the body here? Volume of the body is 1.5 into 1 into 2. So, it is no need of any calculator. So, it is a 3 meter coming around 3 meter cube. Now, in water, what is the weight of that particular body which is having the volume of 3 meter cube? So, the weight of body in water is how much? It is 1962 Newton. Yes. So, these are the two things which is given to you. So, what you have to find out? You have to find out its weight in air and its specific gravity. Yes. So, the weight of the body in water is 1962. And we already have studied the concept that whenever you are putting a particular body in any fluid, some of the what some of the particular fluid will be displaced from the container in which the fluid is there. So, you know if you want to find out what is the volume of the body, it is nothing but the volume of the water displaced. So, already we know what is the volume of the body. Okay. So, if you volume of the water displaced okay is nothing but the volume of the body which you already know that is it is 3 meter cube okay <coughs> excuse me then let us find out we already know what is the volume of the water displaced let us find out the weight, weight of the water displaced. Weight of the water displaced, you know already it is rho g v as we have seen, you can go through the previous video. So, rho is 1000 into 9.81 into your volume is 3 meter cube. <coughs> Okay, so let us the calculator one thousand into nine point eight one into three. So you got how much? Two thousand sorry twenty nine no 
Newton. <coughs> okay, so this is the weight of the water displaced. Now we already know what is the weight of the body in water. So the weight of body in air minus weight of weight of water displaced or you can write weight of body in water also yes I have taken to the other side the weight of the body in air minus weight of the water displaced is nothing but the weight of body in water so actually it is weight of the body in air minus weight of the body in water minus is equal to weight of the water displaced. Yes, I have changed the. <coughs> yes. So, weight of the body in air is equal to weight of the body in water plus weight of water displaced. Okay. So, weight of the body in water is 1962 here, which is all, which was already given. Okay. Then, weight of the water displaced is we got it as here you can see that is 29430. So, again 29430 plus 1962. So, you got how much? 31,392 meter. Okay. So, this is the weight of the body, weight of the body in air. That is 31,392 meter. Okay. So, this is how we are we have solved one one part of the problem. So, the second part of the problem is we have found out what is the weight in air. Let us find out what will be it, the specific gravity of the body. Again, the same procedure, the mass of the body. What is the mass of the body? Mass of the body is weight of the body in air by G. So, 31392 by 9.81. So, 31392 divided by 9.81. So, it, it is 3200 kg. Okay. So, this is the mass of the body. Now, let us calculate what is the density? The main reason why you are calculating the mass of the body because in density is the mass of mass by volume. That is the reason why you are calculating the mass of the body in order to calculate its density. Why you are calculating density is in order to calculate the specific gravity. That is what he is saying is to find it out in the question. So, 3200 by volume you got it as how much? 3 volume this. Okay. So, 3200 divided by 3. So, let us round it off 1066. I round it in round 0.67 kg per meter cube. So, this is the density of the fuel. So, but we are here we have to find out the specific gravity of the body. The specific gravity of the body, what is the formula? The density of the body, which you got is as 1066.67 by the density of the standard fluid, and the standard fluid is 1000. Okay. 
So, it will come and out 1.067. So, this is the specific gravity of the body. So, this is how we got the answer. Yeah. So, thank you for your patience with me. Let us meet in the next video. Thank you.